Hello, today I'd like to show you how to use MATLAB to, uh, to write like a small program how to square fitting a data. So the simplest one we are going, I'm going to show you today is the linear uh, square fitting and the next video I'm going to show you the nonlinear one. Anyway, for the linear one, so we start with a function call the function square fitting or whatever as fit and then an integer n and represent the number of the point you are going to get from your experiment or whatever project you have <coughs> then define a vector number one then we'll ask you to input the values of x so just x component of the point you will put them later when we run the program I'll show them to end. Then we will save it as a <coughs> like um, vector, call it x. Same thing we do for the y component, for the point. So now we have x and y. n is the number of the points, how many points we enter, 5, 15, 50, whatever. And then here the, we, we compose a um, square matrix, in this case 2 by 2, because this is a linear square fitting so we are looking for the value of the y-intercept and the slope itself anyway so we have four elements first one will be n second one will be the sum of x component and the element to one is the sum so this is the same that's a symmetric matrix and the last component is the sum of x square itself as soon as we get this one then we need the inverse of it so that's inverse m and we multiply it by a column vector that column vector composed of two elements first one is sum of y component and second one is the sum of the multiplication of each element so like we multiply x times y x times y and then that's it we get the um, m and B which is the slope and the Y intercept let's run the program and see how it's work so it's a square fit let's start with a trivial example of three points then I put this to remind you to use these kinds of brackets and so values of X let's say one two and three here just to be sure that you enter the right and, and then the values of y let's say this is trivial one let's say two four six so we obviously we know the answer enter then here's go that's the answer zero is the uh, is the y intercept and two is the slope you could try it for any any function or any uh, kind of the this is the linear one yeah uh, I'm going to show you later the non-linear one uh, thanks for watching my video if you have any question please uh, you know what no, that's it.